Uh, this question was sent to me from a uh, Stanford uh, University student and also the same question, this one, a uh, phone in the Cambridge uh, exam. So let's get started. So what can I say? Uh, this is, uh, excuse me, this is a uh, sex substitution. How do you know? When you have a root and they have an x squared minus a squared, this is sec. So you let x equal to a sec angle. I want to show you so you can understand. But if you start with a square, if it's like this, number minus x squared, and then this is sine substitution. So you say x equal to a sine of angle. Okay? But if it's a squared plus x squared, and this is tan substitution, other way around, either way around. For tan, it can be other way, because if you have a 1 plus 2, the same say 2 plus 1. But for this, you can have the other way around, because if you say 1 minus 2 and 2 minus 1, is two different things that are not equal to each other. See? Now, let's go to the business. So this is going to be sec squared, because it's x minus that content. Okay, now let's go. So I'm going to say now, let 9 meaning 3 squared. So let... Okay, how are we going to say x equal to 3? Equal to 3 squared. And they say your second sec angle. And the next thing you're going to say, uh, differentiate. My pen is just getting finished a little bit. Differentiate x, you get d. dx, when you differentiate this, going to be 3. And then it's going to be sec angle, tan angle. d, d theta. When you differentiate sec. Now, what we do, we can substitute back. So it's going to be integral. x, x is 3. But it's x squared. 3 sec theta means it's going to be 9 sec square of angle and then minus 9 and then you have a root in there over x. x equal to 3 sec per square means it's going to be 9 sec square. It's going to be 9 sec square. And then d theta dx. dx equal to 3. So dx equal to 3 sec angle tongue angle d theta. See? So all of this equal to tan theta. So if you don't know how that, why and how, look, I'll take you to the trigger a little, okay? Trigger, I tend to say, if you have a sign, let's say square of angle plus cos, square of angle equal to 1. Look, I want to have a relationship between sec. How do I get sec here? I know sec, for me to get sec, it has to be 1 over what? 1 over cos. But everything has a square, so say divided by cos square. So I have a sec, and then divided by everything by cos square. Divided by cos square. Look, this and this cancel, so 1 plus... This equal tan square equal to sec square, which is same as this one. So what happened here? Look, you take three nine out of the bracket, and then this gonna be sec square minus one. But what is sec square minus one? Sec square minus one. Sec square minus one equal to tan square. So this half here is gonna be square root of sec square minus one equal to tan square. And what is tan square equal to just a tan? Angle. But here it's going to be 3. That's why I say this is going to be 3. 3 what? Turn. See, I was just explaining to you. With me, I can just do them with the head, but I'm just doing for you to understand, okay? Because you said me question, so you want to make sure that you understand. So this is going to be equal. This is going to be 3 integral, 3 sec, 3 turn angle, and then over 9 sec square angle, and then. Here on top is going to be 3 and then sec angle turn of angle d. d theta. Some of the stuff I'm going to cancel. Look, 3 and 3 go to 9. Cut to the 9. Cut to the 9. 1 sec and 1 sec. So we're going to have a tan square over sec. So right here I'm going to have an integral of tan square. That means tan square and then over sec d theta. But what is tan square? Tan square goes to sec square minus 1. So this let me say integral, integral, and then I'll say sec square angle minus one <coughs> over sec x. So I'll say this is over sec angle and this over sec angle. D theta. But uh, one of this and one of this gonna cancel. So this let me say uh, okay, see, see. equal to integral. <coughs> So one second, one second cancel, so it's going to be integral of sec, angle, d, theta. Now we come here minus, but what, what is one of a sec? One of a sec equal to cos. So same as say integral of cos, angle, d, theta. So this one we know. 
when you're in a good sack, you get a lot of sack turn. Okay, so when you're in a good sack, it's going to give us long, absolute sack, angle plus turn, angle. Now you come here. When you're in a good course, you get sine of angle. So minus, minus, sine of angle. Sine of angle, sine of angle. So now, if you look back to the question, the question was not in terms of uh, theta, theta, theta. The question is in terms of x. So we have to substitute that. What is sec? Sec equal to x over 3. See? So we know this sec is going to be x over 3. So sec we know. What about tan? So let me show how you can get tan. So you can say here, we come back here, right? Come back here. Now we know sec, not sec. Sec theta equal to x over 3. x over 3. And you want to get tan. But what you can do, square here. When you square here, this going to be square and this going to be 9. You see what I'm saying? Now, we want to get, uh, we go to the identity. So we know sec square equal to 1 plus tan square. See? So now, I want to get tan here so I can come here. Okay, what is tan? Tan equals sec square minus 1. So tan equal to sec square minus 1 equal to tan. But it's not tan, equal to tan square. But we want to get only tan. So square root this side and square root this side. So tan of angle equal to sec square. And what is sec square? x square over 9 minus 1 root. But I can find the common denominator. Multiply by 9, it's like this. Okay, multiply by 9 here is like this is going to be square root of, this is going to be x square, x square minus 9 over 9. Denominator. But we can separate the roots is acceptable. If you have a square root of x over y, this I may say square root of x over square root of y. So I can separate, I can say, okay, square root of that one and square root of this. For a reason, because I know the denominator is going to give me 3. So when you square root 9, you're going to get 3. So this is going to give me what? 3. So all of this divided by 3. And this is equal to tan of angle. <coughs> so for that case, now I can substitute back. See, but uh, now we don't know sign. How are we going to get sign? See, so I can use the same expression here to get sine. So now look, tan, I do have tan. I do have a sec. Sec equal to sec angle equal to x over 3. x over 3. So I have a sec, I have a tan. Now we want to get sine. Look, it's easy. How are you going to get sine? So sec we have, and you have what? Tan. How are you going to get uh, sine? Look, it's very easy. So I'm going to do, look, I will take this one here. Uh, okay, let me do here. Divided by 3, divided by 3. So it's going to be x over 3. So now, what is sec? Sec is, what is sec? Sec is 1 over cos. So I can say 1 over cos of angle equal to x over 3. Let's flip it. So this is going to be cos of angle equal to 3 over x. So for that case, now let me draw a little triangle here. So for a little triangle, it's going to be, let's draw an innocent triangle, very small triangle. Our angle equal to theta. But what is cos? Cos equal to adjacent over hypotenuse so adjacent equal to 3 and hypotenuse equal to x so we can get the opposite how are we going to get the opposite x square minus 9 because it's going to be 3 square equal to 9 from the law of the pythagoras so we can use this to get sine oh yes of course so what is our sign our sign equal opposite what is the opposite sine equal to opposite sine of angle equal to opposite what is the opposite this one right here, x squared minus 9 over, over, hypotenuse equal to x. You see what I'm saying? So now you have everything. You have a sec, or a sec, sec is this one. You have a turn, turn this, and you have a sine equal to that. So what we can do, substitute back, and that's going to be the end of the question. So what we can do, uh, I can just simply finish here, or I can erase here. Okay, let's just do here. So this equal to long long okay long long okay long you just say long now sec what is our sec our sec is this one here so we say uh let's just erase this okay, right here. okay our sec is uh this one here so square root of what of x square minus nine over three plus tan what is a tan our tan equal to tan tan i don't see tan hmm. Hold on. This is our sec. What is our sec? Our sec equal to x over 3. Our sec equal to x over 3. And then we plug.
plus, okay? So now we can plug everything. So we say eco, equal to loan, you just say loan. Okay, here we have our three, just a triangle. Okay, I just leave a space there. Long sec, what is a sec? Our sec equal to x over three. X over three, and then we plus, we plus our tan. Tan equal to, tan equal to, square root of, x square minus nine, and then over three, absolute. Now minus, minus sign, sign equal to this one here. So you see, x square minus nine, root over x. That's it. If you want, you can put a single, one over three for both. So you can just see there's three, there's three. So I can take three out only if you want a stony side. Say bracket, bracket, one over three. And this can be the end of the equation. See, uh, I believe in how I do things in my methods on how I do things. Just like I said, this question here comes from uh, some of the students from overseas. So I hope you learn uh, from my method and how to do things. If first time, make sure you do subscribe and share this video to a lot of people so you don't just only you benefit, okay? Send it to the other university student or some student who does calculus, like student from UK, student from the Cambridge uh, University or some brother and sister from the continent of the Africa motherland. Send to everybody, man. Let's share and they say knowledge is power and that's why I take my time out to share the knowledge that I know so we can all have a power. Thanks a lot and a life. See you soon. Peace. Oh, peace. 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 Thanks a lot. Thanks, Melissa. Thank you. My queen, you go when me to Jesus come. Qua when I talk, pocket full flows, money, honey, forget about Susan. So, since we don't have all the equipment like you know, cameras and all this stuff, so just use one of the uh, webcam from my, my, my computer.